What was the thinking or reasoning behind the concept of MTE? It was to stop um, this narrow focus um, of one person from a company talking to one person on the mine hoping to get business out of it and trying to get, we're dealing with usually large manufacturing companies and mines are big and trying to get them interlocked by getting a lot of people involved with a lot of people uh, and that had the benefit of linking the supplier with the user um, and the idea of the exhibition really was to be able to well, several things to show a complete range of products as opposed to perhaps a product which you can put on a man's table whereas if you have a stand you can show um, your whole range or as much of it as you wish to share When I started the business, um, I was working for tube makers of South Africa and I was heavily involved in selling and marketing to the mines and I saw the opportunity Health and safety is absolutely critical and a lot of exhibits took that into account. Um, the the anti-mud rush barriers, the uh, safety devices to stop falls, the um, anti-derailing devices on tramming, all of those things were, were very important. That's particularly true in things like the uh, eastern wing of the platinum belt. There are a lot of um, potentially tremendous mines there that are sort of holding their breath and waiting for things to improve. So whilst that's going on, you need to go outside to other countries where the mining is stronger. You have to go outside South African borders and it's a positive development I'm very pleased about. I always felt that the finest things that came out of the shows were ideas that were produced by the people that worked on the mines. I would say that that, that area is very important. Um, there are a lot of people on the mines with great ideas.